How is it going everyone? Richard here again and I'm back with another wonderful tutorial. So if you like our videos, just subscribe and take the notification bell to stay updated with our new content. In this tutorial, you will learn how you can upload large size plugins to your WordPress site even if your website is just hosted on shared hosting with limited resources. So with that said, let's get started with this tutorial. Okay, I am now on the dashboard of my WordPress site. So the first thing that we want to do in here is to head over to our plugin section and click on add new so that we can, uh, we can add a new plugin for us to be able to upload larger size files or plugin to our WordPress site. So the name of the plugin that we are going to install in here is upload large or larger plugin. So it's loading right now. Okay, let's check. I think it's plugins. Let me double check. Still, it's none. Oh, I have just misspelled it. So just remove the I in, in there. Okay, here we go. This is the one that we are going to install in our WordPress site. So click on install. The name of the plugin is Upload Larger Plugins and uh, the uh, developer of this plugin is David Anderson. So before we are going to activate this plugin, I am going to show you something, okay? I am actually on unlimited hosting. So I am going to first, um, before I'm going to activate this one, let me show you an example. I will just upload a large plugin in here. This plugin that I am going to upload is Beaver Builder plugin and it's a light version it's a free version so let me show you something i am now clicking install to upload the plugin to my wordpress site and let's just wait for a while that's what you can see in here on the uh, on the upper part upper right corner you can see that it's still loading up so let's just wait for a while and you will see the error message that will show up later okay here it is it shows up with an error. The error says the uploaded file exceeds the upload max file size directive in php.ini. So let's press back again so that we can go back to our uh, plugin section. So as what you can see in the example, I am not even if the uh, size of the plugin is just 5 megabytes, it's still not able to be uploaded. To this website so what I'm going to do is to just activate this one so I'm going to since it's already installed in my WordPress site I am just going to activate this here okay here it is this is the the plugin that we have just installed earlier this is the solution and one of the good thing about this plugin that I like is that it's a very lightweight plugin so since it's already activated because I have just clicked activate so I am now able to upload large size plugins so let's go back to plugins and click add new for us to be able to upload the new plugin to our WordPress site as what you can see it shows up that it's different now but we are going to select files to upload new plugin or just dra drag and drop this new plugin that we want to install to our WordPress site and here we go here it is the new plugin is already on the process of being installed without any kind of error whatsoever so we only need to wait for a while until it's done uploading once it's done uploading by the way you will see that it will be on the process of being installed to our WordPress site by the time it's finished uploading Okay, as what you can see, the plugin is completely uploaded to our WordPress site without any kind of error whatsoever. So, let's just wait for a while. It's still unpacking. Okay, here it is. It's successfully installed. We only need to activate it to activate the plugin so that we can use right away the plugin. So, there is no any kind of error. You cannot see any error in activating or in installing this plugin to our WordPress site. Though the plugin is a large size plugin still 
I am able to install and activate it in my WordPress site. Using this plugin, the Upload Larger plugins. So that's how easy it is for you to install or upload large file size plugins to your WordPress site. So if you found this video helpful, please give us a like, subscribe, and share this with others. That's all for now. Once again, this is Richard from WP Reformer. Thanks for watching and see you on my next video.